Hello, BookTube. Hello, BookTube. <laughs> I have a mail haul for you. It's not very big. I think the mail carriages are scarred by the beastly weather. Uh, but it has not one, but two boxes. And both the boxes are big. Uh, so that's nice. <laughs> that might compensate. First, we'll start with this little thing, though. Whatever this is. This is this little manila envelope here. It could be... Oh, it's an advanced copy of something. Oh, fantastic. Oh, very nice. Uh, this is uh, American Stories. It's a new short story collection by the great John Edgar Wideman. Oh, fantastic. Look at that. And the cover is uh, the Brooklyn Bridge, only vertical. So very nice. And this comes out in the spring, if I remember correctly. Yes, this comes out in March. Uh, great. Fantastic. Uh, and let's see here. Are they going to mention his, his books include American Histories, Writing to Save a Life, Philadelphia Fire, Brothers and Keepers, which is great, nonfiction, Father Long, Hoop Dreams, Sent for You Yesterday. Uh, but is that the whole list of his work? That is not the whole list of his work. He has, I wonder if they have a whole list here. No, they don't. Ooh. Well, he's great. <laughs> he has other things, aside from those that are listed. This is, this is. Uh, I'm really hoping I get to review it. That would be great. Uh, and now we'll do the boxes. If Frida will let us, I don't, I don't know if she will... If she will let us. This one is big but light as a feather. If this is one mass market paperback, I'm going to have words with a public. Uh, what is this little girl? What's in here? Packing material. Oh, it is one little paperback. Can you believe that? Uh, what is it? Dreadful Young Ladies and Other Stories by Kelly Barnhill. It looks like YA. Uh, a little bit surprising. Uh, for award-winning New York Times best-selling author oh, yeah. Kelly Barnhill. You know this book? The Girl Who Drank the Moon? Yeah, it won the um, Newbery. Uh, it comes a, a stunning collection of stories teeming with uncanny characters whose lives unfold in worlds at once strikingly human and eerily original. Okay. All right, so this is a collection of short stories from someone who won the Newbery. Okay, all right, that comes out in February. Notice it's exactly the same size as something that came in a little manila envelope. So, But this next one, if I remember correctly, is heavy. This one's yes? heavy. Okay, so this could be a Steve book. We could be ending with a Steve book. Here, make yourself useful. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <Ugh>. Oh! oh. <laughs> Frida escaped. I had her up on my lap because she was bothering Malin. And that's the one rule here. The one rule is that you don't bother Malin. Uh, so we'll, we'll have to hope that she's forgotten that she was doing that. What is this? Oh! <laughs> it's not only Steve's book, it's many Steve's books. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm spooching. <laughs> it's a box full of Itati Classical Library. This is the Harvard University Press's ongoing... They do the Loeb Classical Library system, which is all Greek and Latin classics. The Greek and Latin on one side, the English on the other. And they, they now do Itati, from the Itati Library, uh, of Renaissance classics. And what have we got here? So this is... Uh, Goodness gracious. <laughs> so the first one is The Genealogy of the Gods by Boccaccio. Uh, this is volume two. Uh, I already uh, read and loved volume one. <laughs> if I remember correctly, I will inflict upon you my review. <laughs> uh, and then we have uh, Marsilio Ficino. This is uh, Commentaries on Plotinus. And this is uh, volume four, because he wrote, he was big on Plotinus. <laughs> I don't really know why. <laughs> this is a new translation with commentary that is so incredible. Oh, oh fantastic. These are landmark editions. Not so much, I mean, Ficino has had, has had lots of critical attention, and so has Boccaccio. But some of these, the characters, the writers here are minor. Uh, and then Manetti, against the Jews and the Gentiles. In a new in a new translation with commentary, fantastic, uh, a controversial book. It's 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 great that they're including it in the system in this whole Frida. library. Oh, is she eating plastic? Yeah. Goodness gracious! 
Yeah, try go along for a minute. Come here. Here, try a box instead. Yeah. <laughs> well done, Steve. Uh, well, we're... Oh, no, she went back to the plastic. Well, we'll... Well, we have to go address the dog we'll, before we'll she kills her herself. Route. But we'll do a, a Steve Pyramid. So we have the Itati Library, the latest in the Itati Library. What a thrill. Uh, and then a YA book and John Andrew Weidman's new uh, collection of short stories. So there you go. That was a, a two-box mail haul. <laughs> a two-box and two old bitty beans. <laughs> Thank you both too for letting me be part of uh, Steve's mail hall. We're gonna go eat again. <laughs> Bye. Bye.